Welcome back to another episode of Bruise and Bravery. I'm playing a new game, Color Symphony, by myself as Ryan kicking it, drinking my honey brown amber ale that I made myself, testing it out today. I'm going to play one of these side scrolling platformer games. Uh, this one has an interesting concept. I am terrible at these, that's why I'm playing it, because hopefully I will improve my skills. And abandon a place no one knows. Oh, look at these really cool graphics. You got like newspaper print font and the guy with a really crazy jacket. It's just like that movie uh, with the vampires and the werewolves with the girls at the top. She goes to jump down and kill her. Here is a man. One man alone. One man with a blindfold over his eye because he stabbed it running with scissors who is hurt by a trusted friend. He's, no, his vampire friend hurt him and thrown into hell. Youch, that sucks. Oh, he is a vampire with a broken nose and an eye. No eye. In reality, with no pleasure or hap no happiness. That is a real bummer. So he jumps off the top of his building now and plunges downward below the crescent moon he starts a dangerous journey to grab the very last ray of light what a depressing story i i am i am for well i guess i like the light so okay got it colors make combination so i hit space 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 jumping around i just be level one huh so to get rid of this one, I go blue, and then to get rid of this one, I go green, and then get yellow, and then I jump, oh, in the wall, yeah! Sweet, so I can just jump there, and now I'm back. Cool. What does it, it say? Ten years later, I return home to my home. World seeking revenge. Revenge from what? Revenge from my shitty hand. Alright, get rid of those branches. Fall down. Oh shit. I totally died. Continue. Yes! I will choose to continue. I choose life! This is really cool, my silhouette. It looks like I'm running really fast and it's windy, but then as soon as I stop, BAM! And apparently I can't touch birds. Birds are bad. Because I'm really not good at this whole color system yet, so I haven't figured that part out. Drink beer very fast like. Deadly wild boars. Adnan Tarantal. Oh, let's see if there's more lettering. What happened? This world has been changed so much, so I cannot find anything that I had in the past. It's so emo. It's got video games. 
face. Just because you're a vampire person. That really means that you have to fucking hate the world. There's lots of happy vampires. They smile. They find human girls whose blood they can feast on and they sparkle in the light. Those vampires found happiness. I'm really bad at jumping. Why can I not? Okay, so you gotta... You can't hit the side of the ledge or else the physics messes up. Apparently, I look like a person, but I'm really just a square block. Ah! I hit the wrong button, like, just at the wrong time. This is really bad. This is basically, I think, where the game has to end up because I, I'm being crushed by plants. with my hat tipping. Wah, flying through the air, tipping my hat to all the ladies. Okay, I get it. I found the ledge, the secret hidden ledge. And then, oh, oh. I found the door! Awesome, this is, this is kind of a cool concept, though. Um, I think flying birds are beautiful, especially colored ones, so it uh, disagrees with my personal philosophy of how I oh, oh. Alright, then we can go down there. There's only that. mess with me, but then you didn't because you're a different color. What up? Out one door in the next. Oh fuck. Those goddamn uh fuck so uh. Ah! Thank you.